What's up, peeps, and welcome to Prison Architect with me, your host, Zad19. I am joined by the lovely Cory Masho. Hello. The wife. All right. <laughs> Technically, so, it's a walk back to Prison Architect. Yeah, because... Because this is our second series of Prison Architect. We didn't actually get to finish the first one because while we were recording, something went wrong, and the recording did not work. Yeah. And we had saved the progress and finished the thing... And yeah, it sucked. It was bad. Bad times. Yeah. Yeah, it was horrible. It didn't. Uh, it didn't turn out like planned. So we lost the chance at recording episode five, which was gonna be the finale, anyways. So here we are. We're gonna do another series. Because we can. <laughs> yep. And when y'all see this, this should be on Wednesday, right after Minecraft. Uh, how I'm gonna set Minecraft. up uh, the weekly <laughs> uh, uploads. It's gonna be Stardew Valley Slime Rancher on Monday uh, until Slime Rancher runs out and then something else will take its place. None of your workmen are doing their thing. They're meandering around. I know. This isn't our prison. This is just the one that loads up when you load up the game. Oh, I didn't yeah. know that. See, I'm still a Ricky. Yeah. So on Wednesdays we're going to have Minecraft and uh, Prison Architect. And then on Fridays, I'm going to have FNAF Fridays. Woo! Basically, I'm going to FNAF times. post a single video on Friday, but it will be a 30-minute long video uh, of just FNAF. I've I'm got, not playing this time. He is. Yeah. I've got <laughs> FNAF 1 and 2. I've got Five Nights at Fuckboys 1 and uh, 2 and 3, and I've got The Desolate Room, which isn't FNAF, but it's by Scott Cawthon, so I'm gonna play it anyways. Um, and if all of that goes over well, I'll get, well, I have FNAF World, but I'll also get Five Nights at Freddy's 3 and 4, uh, if that all goes well. And this is months down the line, because one episode every Friday might take two, three episodes to beat one game, so who knows? We'll see how things go. But, alright. Enough talking about the channel. Let's get into the prison. Uh, we're going to create a we're new prison. We're going to prison now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, it's been a long time since I've actually made a new prison. I played the tutorial uh, on my laptop just for funsies, but I didn't get to see any of this new stuff. Uh, apparently we can have a female-only prison now, which is interesting. I'm not going to do it because... Because we are not orange is the new black. <laughs> right. Uh, the lobbyist... Disclaimer, I've never actually watched that show. ...has the likelihood of receiving prisoners who are violent, lethal, volatile, deadly, or fighters. Sounds like a good guy. Rita has the likelihood of prisoners being stoical or fearless. Prisoners are suppressed twice as quickly. That's terrifying. Periwinkle. I might just choose him because of the name. Guard dogs have a 50% chance of fully uncovering any tunnels they detect. That's Ooh. cool. It's really cool. A pacifier. Reduces the overall temperature of your prison, making your inmates less likely to cause trouble. Mm. And... Uh, Safara Aknova gets a small cut of the resale value of each piece of contraband found. Uh, prisoners found with contraband will be fined directly from their savings. Ooh. Ooh. So we know there's going to be contraband. There's always contraband. It's a prison architect. I know, right? Hmm. I like the dog guy. The dog guy, Periwinkle? Uh-huh. Because uh, his name is Periwinkle. <laughs> right? So we're going to do a large prison this time. Ooh, I think we did a large one uh, last time. Fog of War... Uh, no, thank you. I would like to actually see stuff. No lakes, no buildings. Failure conditions will have that on. Gangs. Negatory. Negatory. Events. Causes events to occur during the game to keep you on your toes. Adds extra challenge. and element of unpredictability. Sure. Mm -hmm. Weather and temperature. Requiring you to think about heating. Huh. No, thanks. I I'm very vanilla. I don't care if they, you know, freeze to death. They're prisoners, after all. I still haven't decided if this is going to be like a, uh... Let's pause this real quick. If this is going to be a... Like a, a maximum security prison, or what? 
number per day. We're gonna do five a day, I guess. So which do you want to do, min, max, or medium? Um, let's start with medium. Minimum security is no fun. <laughs> right. We'll just take all of the medium security prisoners, or at least five a day. And then after we actually get some infrastructure, then we start taking maximum security. I got eight workers, which means I have to hire two more immediately because I'm... Uh, OCD like that. Yeah. I just found the the bag of jelly beans. Did you find it? I found it. <gasps> Gasp. Alright. Just remember, our mics pick up a lot. Yeah, I know. But jelly beans. I know, right? Uh, let's see. We're gonna pick the basic detention center and... Basically just a couple of oversized children. Yeah. With ADD. Jelly beans! Chocolate! Right? Okay, so, uh, I'm not going to plan this prison out this time. Let's turn the auto lights off, and everything's going to be concrete because I'm a bastard. Uh, let's see. How does that make you a bastard? Because I'm awesome. Here. I do not want it to be, well. You're so weird. Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna do this. It's gonna be eleven. One in the center, two, and then two. Yes. Something like that. Oops. No, that's wrong. <laughs> eleven, and then I want. Seven, I guess. An 11 by 7 for the entrance. Uh, I'm going to shrink this just a little bit. Because I'm going to be moving that garbage, garbage, there it is. Down, and then deliveries. Garbage. Up. And deliveries. Deliveries. Oh my god, deliveries! <laughs> yeah, my mom discovered the Ermagerd thing, and now everything is Ermagerd. I'm not sure she actually gets it, but it's still funny. Jeez, <laughs> <laughs> oh, paving stones. Oh right, I should have this. It looks on like that. a padlock. And slow, so it that really my workers does. can show up. There they are. A little bit. This is the uh, where they first come in. I think it's called the reception room. Where is it at? It's reception. A, yeah. It's a foyer. Uh, where prisoners are first taken when they arrive, and then off to the side of that, I'm gonna have the uh, visitation when I get it built. Uh, off the other side would be the offices, I guess. I have to build a power room at some point. Which I'm not sure where I'm going to put that. Up and to the left. Let's see. Need how much space for an office? Office, office, office. office. Wait, it's been a while since we've done anything like this. I know, right? Reception, office. There we are. Four by four. By four. So I need concrete. Let's see, it's got to be a four by four, which means the room has to be at least six by six to fit it. If I want a hallway, it's got to be bigger than that. So this is already a mistake. It's not big enough. It makes me sad. It's definitely not big enough. Damn. I fail at life. You don't fail at life. I click the cancel. All those, all of that. All their hard work. Eh, they got paid for it, it's fine. <laughs> if this was not a video game, I would be beating the crap out of you. Objects, dismantle object. 
get those two out of the way and I'll build a new foundation brick. That needs to be at least 10. 11 by 10, something like that. Okay, and then this needs to be at least by 6, and if I want a hallway of 2, that means it comes out to here. Because, right? Room, wall there, hallway. Should be big enough. I'm gonna make it this big for the funsies. For the funsies! I'm gonna start thumping you every time you say that. <laughs> like, I'll get an ID card and use it to hit you. <laughs> What are you doing? One, two, three, four, five, wall. Uh, I'm building space for the offices. For the warden. Ooh, the snipers. Don't snipers. need snipers. You need space for the prisoners. Fine. They have so have somewhere to go. I know. <sighs> you know, at least build the holding cell. Uh, I'm getting to it, I'm getting to it. Uh, concrete, I want empty space, path, path, empty space, wall. I'll have it at 11 by 10 as well. And that'll be the holding cell. It's kind of a small holding cell. Well, it doesn't need to be very big because I'll have actual cells for prisoners. And I believe... Oh, really? Quick build. Basic cells. Oh, quick, quick build is a cheesy way out. Luxury cells. Damn, son. They get a computer, a TV, a radio, a shower, a toilet, and a bookcase. Yeah, fuck that shit. Shared cell. Two bunk beds. Should this be like a giant shared cell kind of thing? Don't look at me, man. I don't know. I was just down for the original way to do shit. I think I'm gonna do it with one bunk bed. and It'll have two prisoners per cell. If they kill each other in the middle of the night, so be it. They lose their bum buddy. Wow. wow. I know I'm terrible. Objects. I need to put Ooh, large jail doors. There and there. And then this I'm gonna have Guess This is one of those games that makes me want to just go for a run. For a run? Yeah. A beer run. B double E double R U N. You're so silly. I love you. You think I came up with that? No. Okay. Uh, come on. Come on, come on, come on. Tell your little dudes they're wasting time. They are wasting time. They're tearing down uh, trees. Trees. Which are in the way, admittedly. Still. There needs to not be that in my way. You know, you, you could turn, the, turn it up so it goes faster. I know. I'm just trying to think while I'm building. Well, I thought I smelled smoke. I know, right? Wait, okay. he doesn't even argue anymore. <laughs> nope. What is it that they say? Uh, a foolish man argues with his wife, something like that. I don't know if that's actually a saying, but I'm certainly not going to dispute it. Right? <laughs> oh, I, yeah, that's fine. No, I don't need that. I need jail or a, uh, a staff door because. Well, then you need another piece of wall. I know. I'll get to it. Boop. Boop. No, 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 no! Stop that. Metal detectors? Metal detectors. See? See? I'm learning. Alright, so. I need... This is kind of an educational two, experience three, for me. I don't play this game, so I have no idea what we're doing. Okay. Oh. Don't do that. That's a 4x4. Four four. Yes, that's a 4x4. Four four. Uh, 
I was totally watching Fringe. That'll be the warden's office. All the way down on the end, because I can. Oh, that one's too small. <sighs> Damn it. No wonder why it worked out so well. Let's pause Poor this. Poor little place for the dogs. No? Okay. Nope. You don't want to put the kennel in there? Nope. Walls, 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 walls. We're waiting every One, night two, to find a leaf room and invite the comers to play with us. <laughs> One, two, three, four. Okay. Now they're all the same size. Yep, now they are all the same size. The warden gets no special treatment. Nope. That would be too easy. I really want ice cream now. I'm sorry. <sighs> there's not like a 24 hour... Yeah, there is. There's a 7-Eleven right up the road. Is there? It... Yeah. On 8th Street. Heading toward the highway. I think that'll be a cleaning closet. I'm not sure yet. But I'll have the, uh, the power up here later. Let's get the... Get this marked for reception. And get offices picked out here. Now why do we need so many offices? Warden, police chief, foreman, and... Psychologist? Accountant. Oh. Psychologist needs to be able to get to the prisoners. Oh. And so will the foreman eventually, but not right now. I'll move his office when I feel like it's necessary. Let's get the warden brought in. Get his desk pimped out so he can start learn doing some bureaucracy. Some uh, some BS stuff up in here. Let's get him a little filing cabinet in the corner. And a gun rack. No, no. No, no. That'd be too nice. Okay. I want a gun rack. <laughs> you want guns. Uh, let's have I have guns. I just desk. can't access them right now because I don't have a safe. Right. Right there. And need a table. Right. Table. Hmm. Let's do. One there and one there. And then we'll have jail door. Nope, put it in the middle. Yeah. It'll be just slightly off center, but that's fine. Now let's get rooms holding cell put in place. That needs to be dismantled. Why is that still there? It's a couple. Toilets. Yeah. Bench. Toilets. One, two, three. Just over in the corner, minding their own business. Bench over here. And let's add... I think that was it, right? Yeah, okay. Well, you could put a couple of beds in there just in case. Yeah. Just in case. Oh, yeah! Yeah, it's enough for ten prisoners to have a bed. Boot camp! No, I'm just kidding. Yeah. <laughs> uh, okay. So. Hey, we had fine accommodations in boot camp. There were, you know, 120 of us in one room. I'm not complaining. We got three squares. Okay. Yeah, you need to set up your power station. Yep, and I need to move the deliveries out of that and move it to here and move garbage out one further. And garbage. The garbage. Foundations. Concrete. I don't need that much space. 
Just remember you're going to want to put extra capacitors around the dang thing. Yeah. So let's do... Okay, so maybe I do know how to play that. this game a little bit. <laughs> so one up there, one down here, and then a water one right there. Maybe. I don't remember how the utilities work. Small pipe, large pipe, water pump station, electrical switch. Visitor booth. Visitor booth. Why is visitor booth? Because when you go to a prison and you sit on either side of the visitor booth, you speak into microphones. Alright. Because the glass is bulletproof. There's visitors' tables, too. Huh. Interesting. Okay. I need to put staff door. Let's do one right there, right in the center, as I can. Hurry up, dudes. Like, you have all the free time in the world. Alright, so the holding cell is set up. Alright. Gotta move quickly. <laughs> Don't have much time left. 17 minutes. Uh, I started the timer after our intro was over, so technically... Yeah. Time to wrap it up, babe. I know. I'm sorry. Uh, Don't apologize to me. Apologize to your load time. I know. I'm so sorry. Uh, okay, guys. Uh, we're going to call it an end to the episode there. I'm going to put a, uh, a shower block right there. Oh, okay. I was going to ask. Yeah. I'm going to make it so that it's open so that they can go in and shower whenever they want. They can't see your hand. No. Oh, I'm going to make it to where it's open right there <laughs> so they can shower whenever they want. That kind of thing. Um, anyways, if you liked the video, please click that like button. And if you want to see more content from me, your host is on 19, be sure to click that subscribe button. And I will see you next time. Bye! Bye-bye.